Okay, here I have jalapenos, onion, poblano, and green peppers for my chili mix. And this is my ground beef I'm going to use. Grass-fed. I like a variety of spices, so I'm gonna use my salt, my chili powder, some chili lime, paprika, and this is some cumin. I'm running out, but I like building my chili on flavor. Okay, and after I have rendered down the beef with the peppers and the onions, these are the ingredients that I'm going to put in my mix and I'm going to blend all of that together. Then I'm going to add my sauce. Now you can use tomato paste or whatever you choose to use. I like rows and I put that right in there and then I let this simmer for about a good 15 minutes and I'm always checking back for flavor. Okay, and this is my fat dough that I always make. I'll leave a link for the recipe, or I'll just leave the recipe, but this is my fat dough. It is a sticky dough, but this is the dough that I use to make my buns, my rolls. And so today I'm gonna shape them into hot dog rolls. Okay, well, these may not be the best shaped looking hot dog, but you know, I shape them just enough so they can bake and then they can be split over. Now they may not rise as high. I put baking powder in there, but let's see how these come out. I'm gonna probably bake these for like about a good 15, 20 minutes. This is the first time I'm trying this, this uh, recipe by making a hot dog roll. So let's see how this flows. Okay, my lovely. I'm ready to bake at 350 for 15 minutes. Nice and soft. Dough is cooked on the bottom. And I took my hot dogs and I'm just frying them just a little bit in the avocado oil. Okay, my lovelies, this is my keto chili on my hot dogs. And this, like I said, the bread I made, this is for the first time. It didn't come out too bad. This is the um, fat dough. So this is my chili hot dog with my homemade chili with some red onions and some mustard and the iconic, of course, hot dog with mustard and sauerkraut. So thank you for watching this video. Like, subscribe, and share. Have a great night. This is Bonnie from Keto Lifestyle 50 Plus. Mmm. Wow. This is good. I had some dough left over, so I made a little bit of pizza there. And that has just onions, olives, sauce, cheese, yum.